December 15th, 2020 Daily Math Review. A chemist needs 2,200 milliliters of potassium chloride to complete an experiment. She has two liters. How many more liters does she need? All right, so first of all, we need to figure out 2,200 milliliters of potassium chloride. Well, how many liters is that? So let's take a look, and then we'll need to see how many more she needs. So what we start with is 2,200 milliliters. So there's our starting point. 2,200 milliliters. We're going to put that over 1. Now, we're going to multiply. We're trying to get to liters, so we need to figure out how many liters that is. So we're trying to get to liters, and we're trying to get rid of those milliliters. So we need to look for liters and milliliters. Here we go, liters and milliliters. It says 1 liter equals 1,000 milliliters. So 1 liter equals 1,000 milliliters. All right, remember our milliliters can cancel out because milliliters divided by milliliters equals one. 2,200 times one is 2,200. And we're gonna keep that liters because we didn't, we didn't um, cross that off. We did not use that. And in our denominator, 1,000 times one is 1,000. Now we can divide 2,200 divided by 1,000 when you divide that, you'll get 2 and 2 tenths liters, so 2.2 liters. All right, so 2.2 liters is how much she needs. So that's how much she needs. She has 2 liters, so how many more liters does she need? If she has 2 liters, well, she's going to need, well, whatever, 2 minus 2, 2.2 minus 2, 2 and 2 tenths minus 2 because she already has 2. Remember, line up those decimals. We can put a placeholder of 0 with that extra decimal. When we subtract those, we're left with 2 down here. So, um, and then 0 decimal 2. So, 2 tenths more liters. So, she needs 2 tenths more liters. And that's going to be it for our DMR. Great job!